Hey friends and welcome back here on the channel German Reacts. Today we are reacting on the greatest catches in history of the MLB. I really enjoy reacting on baseball these days and I'm really happy about the support you guys give me because it's insane how many guys are subscribing these days, how many guys are liking the videos, writing comments. I really appreciate that. And one thing that was requested was that I should react on catches made by the outfielders. I couldn't find a perfect video for that, but I found this one, which is called MLB Greatest Catches in History. So, yeah, this is what we are reacting on in this video. I hope you guys enjoy. And as always, make sure to like the video and subscribe. And yeah, I'm gonna start the recording now. And let's start the video. Ooh. Holy shit! He made a little but important jump and catched it in the air. And he looks satisfied and not so happy at the same time. <laughs> ah, now he's smiling. He knows what he has done. Crazy effort, to be honest. Crazy effort. And the guy in the background already celebrating, and he knows that was important. Fan was at second base. He stayed cheated up the middle, and that pays huge dividends right there. Ooh, a little broken. Black. I just wanted to say his bed broke. Is this happening a lot, or is it just? One in a thousand times. I mean, this ball is thrown with a speed that is increasingly fast, but uh, increasingly, insanely fast, obviously. But yeah, the breaking bad is also causing damage if you get it in your face. Oh, well, that's crazy. But let's see what he can do for the catch here. Bad and oh, oh. Right. What, a play. oh. what a play! Are you kidding? What I also really like about the American sports is the commentators, which are going crazy all the time. That may be the best I've ever seen. That's a magnificent play right there, right? Wow! Oh, what a God. play by David Wright! <laughs> Do it again! Show it again! Stay to be honest, this doesn't really look like human possible, but okay. That's a reach. Well, David Wright just guaranteed that he will be seen on scoreboards around baseball for the next 20 years. Yes, he will. Morneau. Matt Kemp. What is this as a color for your bed, bro? The other one, that opposite field shot. There's a line drive. Nice hit. Gomez and on comes Lagares. Nah. Come on. I think if it touches the ground, it's not a direct out, what you told me. But I think this one was in the air. So lucky as fuck. Crazy. We'll see plenty of this in the next 24 hours. Just shovels it forward, stays with it. And that ball was dipping off the bat of the pitcher Gomez and still able to come up with that play. That's really insane. And crazy, as you know. No, but. Yeah. Knowing where the ball will drop and being not too fast and not too slow at the same time. That's also really no, only possible if you're really a good sports player. Like, I think this needs training a lot. Outstanding. Two-two pitch again. Liner deep to center field. Back goes McCray. Wow! What? Did you see his back? It was like not like a normal back, like straight. But this one was like. There was really a big angle between the normal and the real position. This was not looking good for his body. What a grab by McCray! Oh, 
Yeah, in this case I can really understand if everybody's clapping. This really didn't look like something which is possible by human. Maybe I can stop it. See this? How in the world is he able to catch this ball? How in the world? <laughs> That's what I meant, like contortionist. This is the word I need to remember. Just comes from the outside and flies into the field of view. Crazy. Well, you know, I'm watching Johnny Gomes and I'm saying he's got no idea where the baseball is and I was not watching Brock Holt. No, I wasn't. And he was tracking it the whole time. <laughs> but that the others are just not really knowing where the ball is at all and he's like, okay, I'm gonna catch it. <laughs> oh. I think this one we have already seen. With some hops and listen to the ovation here from the Philly fans. Well, you know his name? I don't know if you how we pronounce it in America or in English, but in German it would be Asche, which is burnt like stuff. <laughs> That's also kind of funny. They, they appreciate a tremendous play, and they just saw one. They saw a spectacular play. It's one thing to leap. But a lot of times you see a guy leap and come down on his feet. He's not yeah, I already told you last time. This guy can jump as high as hell. He's able to do that because he gets up in the air so high. Watch this. Wow. These guys have control over their body. You can't even imagine how hard it is to get this kind of control. Oh, this one goes straight. And it goes outside, but he makes it. And this is what you told me in the comments. If it goes into, into, uh, into the field, which would be a foul, but you catch it in the air, it's an out as well. Thanks for the information. Oh my goodness. Alcides Escobar makes the catch, and that is an out. They are also like... Okay. Same procedure as the uh, one before. Sensational play by Donaldson. He fell between the tarp and the padded sidewall and he held up to it. Nice haircut. <laughs> now Banker was gonna tag, but you can't to just appreciate the great effort by Josh Donaldson up over and in between. Fans were holding their hands up, and there goes Phil Cousin, the third base umpire, following. What a tremendous play, and especially to hold the glove up. Imagine being the referee running behind him to make sure that he can see everything. It's also not the easiest part. The show. That's the amazing part. As it goes in, the glove stays up to let everybody know he caught it. Please don't run into each other. Didi Gregorius! Wait for it! He's out! How did he catch that? Nice music. I think this music is the best part to stop the video. We are already 9 minutes 50 in, so I'm gonna stop the recording now. I hope you enjoyed this video as always. Leave a like as I told you already. Subscribe and see you guys in the future. Peace!